Hello gentlemen, hello gentlemen, and welcome back to some war game Red Dragon. Uh, last we left off, we were been pushed back quite a bit, but we just received some <laughs> Japanese reinforcements. Uh, we have just enough forces, I believe, to hold each one of the sectors we have now, which is great, because we haven't had enough forces for quite a while. Uh, so the first one of, um, the first plan will be to hold these sectors, um, against the enemy. Uh, second stage of our plan will be to push from Yoso up to Daigu to secure our flanks, and then proceed from Yongdek into Wonju uh, to regain some of those political points, and also take Daijon to regain our forward airbase, with and also reinforce Daijon quite a bit because that airbase is important. After that, we'll try and push on Seoul or Chucheon or Sokcho and try to take that area, but the plan will have to be drawn up. For right now, this new offensive is focused on retaking three three sectors which are critical to getting more uh, political points, which are critical to getting better reinforcements faster. Uh, and I'll start off in Guanju. We're sending most of what we have up against most of what they have. Uh, they have a lot of air force, but we've got air defense and igloos and shit. So let's go ahead and kick the battle on, and uh, just kind of hope that we can get those buggers down. Whew, they got some pretty advanced fighters too, some MiG-29s and a uh, few strike craft. So we might have to make do with a few less than a uh, stellar aircraft. The first thing I want to do... No, it's in here somewhere. No, I have them somewhere, come on. Pull me down. Infrared. This might be the only uh, AA we have. I feel very convinced we had other AA though. I probably got it all exploded at some point. That does sound like something I'd do. Alright, so we'll go ahead and get a ton of minstrels out. I'll separate these up into teams of two. Or minstrels, I suppose I should say, not minstrels. Uh, that's something different. Talk to your parents about it, kids. Um, put those over there. Now, to hold this open area, I will put these guys back here. Um, do 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 do. Take four of these guys. And they'll hold this. I'll take two of them. They'll hold this section right there. And they'll hold this back part right there. Two, four. These guys. Hold right there. Right there. Right there. And that'll do for that. You guys will hold over. Actually, you guys will hold here. You guys will hold here. Do do do. Do 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 do. And that's all our mistrels deployed. They get rid of you. Well, I don't want to cancel my last command unit, but I mean, you're 110, you're 120. Can I, I just want to call out one of these and cancel this guy. So go ahead and start canceling things until I get. Oh, that was enough. All right, uh, Kona Jujai Chua. Call that guy out. And now we have some extra staying power on our command unit. We'll call in some tanks too. Sure, our tanks aren't that expensive. See, we can afford one tank. This will definitely hold that entire sector. Speaking of holding that entire sector, those guys are going to need some help doing that actually. So you guys are actually going to hold deeper in here so that they can't ambush you immediately. You guys are going to hold down this entire portion right here. Don't worry, I'm sure you guys will be moderately to severely alright. And we'll launch the battle and everyone will immediately unload. All of you guys can move fast to not where you are. 
See? Great plan. And immediately the helicopters started coming. What are you shooting at? They've already spotted him? Get deeper into the woods, quickly! You can't die yet, you haven't properly baited the enemies! I guess they're just kind of doing the saturation fire thing. Come on, attack me! You know you want to. Trust me, it's a good idea. Well, they just have grenade launchers on them. <laughs> Jeez, that's that's some firepower, but you guys got nope the fuck out of there. We have to note that grenade launchers are deadly. Ah, the masses. They're wonderful for being troops and stuff. You guys go hide back there. Not in a cowardly sort of way, but more in like a... It's just a recce unit. So I think we can start calling out our other two tanks. <laughs> this unit might not actually be... Do we... Do we wait? Oh shit, they found our command unit? Oh, that was a fuck up on my part. All right. Um, change of plans. Oh, thank God. We need so much more help. So these are infrared missiles. Our infrared ground missiles. Is that the HMS Ark Royal? One helicopter born regiment of Royal Marines. There's the Fosh. Land forces. Um get some actual armor. I wanna double check and see if the battlefield is conducive to armor. So we'll probably be coming from Guanju. We're also out of tanks, so we should see to replacing our tanks. So we'll be coming from this way, so we'll need to defend across this stretch and that stretch. That's more of an infantry kind of thing, which is good because we have a shit ton of infantry. Um, doodle -doo. These guys need to refit. They're kind of out. Hmm. Who's that I'm looking for then that has the refit as well? There's the Hatsus. Keep bringing them over. I believe this is the other escort flotilla. Yeah. We could start pushing up on the Jing House. That battle didn't go well at all. I'm gonna put two battles in this episode just because that was horrible. Um, Air Force. Still just the ROK of Air Force. Eh, we could get the Phantom to do a flyby. Um, everyone hasn't seen any real combat. They haven't real use for stuff yet. Bring out the tanks. Where are the, um, have we found out where the T90s are going yet? Oh, there's the T90s. Alright. You guys are going to need this a lot more than I am. And that's all of our points. Oh, and air defense convoy, since you all don't have air defenses anymore. There. That should do it. Um, so there's Young Deck. Who's, who's invading us? Oh, alright. We'll hold. We'll hold at Bravo then. 
maybe some at Charlie, but mostly at Bravo in that little region right there, and the tank regiments and special forces, uh, versus an infantry regiment, an armor regiment, and the attack helicopter. Uh, what kind of AA capability they have? Looks like none, as far as I can tell. Some Salkos missiles, some BRDMs. Alright, New Year's, New Battle's Resolution. Let's resolve to not fuck this up horribly. <sighs> Good resolution, everyone. I know, thank you. <clears throat> so, bravo. How can we potentially make any helicopters that spawn in this middle portion more hell than they already are going to be by spawning in there? Some Vulcans always help. You guys can just hang out right there. Alright, and then we'll get a... Critical shit ton of infantry. So you guys. Some of you guys. I think you're Stinger missiles, right? And then you guys, who are just gonna kind of hang out in town. Do we have anything else? Um, some more bonbons. Oh. We don't have any more bonbons. More bonbons. I'll put this guy as far away from the fighting as I can put him, possibly. Um, these K1 tanks are also pretty decent tanks, if I remember correctly. Yeah, 85 points, they better be a damn decent tank. Um, I need to put these guys at range. I'll put them in that tree line right there. Oh yeah, that's right. Helicopters. We have those. And we'll put up an AH-1 and a toe, and we'll hang these guys over there. I'm looking for some toe vics now. Well, I might just call, spend the rest of my points on tanks. Or logistics. We'll spend it on logistics, because logistics is cool. Yo. And we'll buy three more tanks, cram those guys in here in reserve. Move one napalm unit over here to defend this area. We'll launch the battle and see how horribly everything goes. And I'm actually gonna move you guys over here. No, not my helicopters. Oh, okay, it's not my helicopters. Apparently there's no real way to... Oh, no. Stop, stop, stop! <laughs> Just keep shooting! Oh my god, the carnage! <laughs> That's right, don't fuck with us! Chase him. Chase him down. Okay, get back here. Unless, you know, you can, like, shoot at him. In which case, then that'd be super cool. Yeah, get back here. Stop panicking. Really the worst thing you can do right now. Oh no, not those hinds. Oh no, not my not my K ones, which aren't properly hidden yet. You guys don't seem to take a freaking hint. No means no. Just rocket the whole fucking town. That's not a war crime. 
We don't have war crimes. This is Korea. There's barely even a war. <laughs> That's right. Just, just keep coming. Nothing bad will happen. <laughs> I just love how they keep trying to get helicopters over this town. They keep not making it. Oh no, not Dong Boyong. Boom, boom boom. <laughs> Annihilated. The sheer amount of annihilation going on right now. Move this AH-1 in to do some more of what it does. Stop, stop, stop! Wreck shit. Do you go higher? No. Change, change your altitude again. Change your altitude to much higher. Get, get higher. <laughs> no one is taking this town from me. Congratulations, I guess. I'm gonna pull these guys back a bit under the supporting cover of my Helma chapter. Oh hey, that's the napalm guy. Good job, napalm guy. We'll bring our other napalm guy over here to help you out. I'm gonna set up my Toho chopper over here to keep an eye out on things. Hmm, guess we didn't have a forward base. Or if we did, that was it. Ah, oh, those are trucks, never mind. Oh look! More Heinz. Actually, I've seen a working version of these. There's only two of them in the uh, northern northern America working, and they're all located. They're both located super close to my house. So it's really cool. Um, I got 45 minute drive. Oh no, Chinoma hose. Boy, have we got a surprise for you. Just strolling down the street, minding your own business. Wait, is that guy in Daegu? Did he never... unload? You should really finish up aiming. Just charge down this street. You'll get it eventually. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. You'll get it eventually. Maybe. More Heinz! More Heinz! This is why there's only two working Heinz in Northern America. The rest of them got blown up in Korea. Oh, guys, get over here, quickly! Surprise, bitch! Stop! I'm gonna bring some logistics up. Some more tanks over here. That should do it. Move some helicopters to the middle field right there. Call some special logistics in just for them. I love this helicopter. It's just a little bird with overpowered weapons. I'm actually move this K1 right up to here. 
wonder what these are. These just basically... Um, these are basically just Shermans. They're not Shermans, um, Abrams, I guess. They got a decent stabilizer. Looks like. But they're just picking off targets really nilly. Look. Look. T-62s. Some more T-62 is pushing. I mean, God, T-62s are effective when you have a lot of them. Find a way to engage that T-62. I'm actually gonna send this guy up here to join this group. Stop. More tanks are trying to advance. Luckily our Korean tanks are just kind of demolishing them. God, that's that's impressive. The shots they're pulling off. Those things have gotta have laser rangefinders on them. Then again, they are also facing up against T-62, so it's easy to look cool when no one knows what they're doing. You guys line up there. You guys line up here. You guys regroup. Into one uber formation. They can't kill us if they're all dead. Stop, stop, stop. You guys come here and land. Actually, just land. We'll get them re-ammoed up. And then these guys will probably run straight into a trap right about there. <laughs> yes, drive down the road. Build with corpses. It will work out fine. <laughs> this guy's got the right idea. He's like, fuck that, I might mind a building. And I think he exploded. Nope. Maybe you can escape? Nope. Everyone inside that tank is kaput. We're grouping to one uber grouping. And that guy. Dave's a bit weird. Ah, we're out of logistics. Huh. Support. And recce. I suppose I can get a few more anti-tank down here. Close range KV... K1s. So these K1s are taking a bit of fire, but... Just about every time they fire, they take out one tank. It's not enough to keep themselves... Good, though. You guys, get, get over here, quickly. These guys are gonna need some help. You guys also fall back deep into the woods. <laughs> that didn't go well at all. And then our Cobra unleashed. And there's the Hind. That's still pretty dangerous. Ugh. These K1s are better at long range. But our Cobra will get up to close range and just, I guess, start unloading. Yeah. Oh shit, oh shit. Okay, that went well. Yeah, so this area is doing pretty damn decent. As you can see by the countryside... Or the jungle? <laughs> Just littered with attack helicopters. 
transport helicopters, other various helicopterly forms of helicopters. These cargo trucks out of stuff. All right, you guys move fast over here. We'll load you up with more stuff later. And your stabilizer is malfunctioning. I advise you fix that quickly. Yep, there's definitely mud on that road. And with seven minutes left, there's some more T-60 whatevers. Taking some fire from the sides. That's actually a pretty cool shot. I'll move this AH-1 over here to intercept these hips. Bridge just stop. Just go up here. Surprise! Cobra gunship! Fall back, fall back, fall back, fall back! T-62s are continuing to try and advance. Not doing too well though, I'll admit. And there goes another hind. Oh, and we lose all our T whatever. So I guess I'll just pull these KVs back to right about there. Pull this KV. Actually I'll pull them back to right about here. Move them fast here. Stop, stop, stop. Protect the broken. Sorry mate, you're hidden actually, so you're this is a good place to be detracted. Alright, all you guys stop. Soon is now trying to push down the other road directly into town. Ah, what did we lose? Um Shit. I kinda needed those. You guys move back inside. We'll let the infantry deal with this. Come on guys, get in there. Alright, so now we've got nothing but K1s. Whew, defending this ridge. But it seems like the main push is T-62s up this ridge. Pull my AA back, because that's really, really important. You know T-62s will get ripped to pieces. Chinomaho is pushing up this side, but getting also getting ripped to pieces by my K1. More Chinomahos. And I'm just going to let the guns speak for themselves now, really. That little bit right there. About three more minutes, but all we need is two more kills. Come on, get in there. Kill something. Kill something big. I think we did it. Start enemy losses. And we destroyed the tank regiment, which means all we gotta face now is a bunch of helicopters and... <laughs> that's... 64 T-62s. With the loss of... 3 K-1s. I would say... That went pretty damn well. 
I've been Tomato. Thank you for watching. I'll see you all in the next part.